Man has long sought to use natural sources of energy to complement human and animal work power. Water mills were one of the first mechanical devices to utilize renewable energy sources. They were built on fast-flowing rivers or streams with canals and sluices constructed to control water levels and speed of flow. The most important structural element of water mills was the water wheel, a large, usually vertical wooden wheel mounted on a horizontal axle. Water wheels were first used in ancient times, but they only became widespread in the Middle Ages. They are driven by water flowing against blades arranged on the outside rim of the wheels. Depending on where the water hits the wheel blades, there are undershot, overshot, or breastshot water wheels and water mills. Power from the vertical water wheel is transferred to the upright shaft that rotates the millstone inside the mill by means of gears and a shaft extending from the axle. The millstones are placed in casings on the top floor of the mills. The grain is fed into them through a hopper. The ground material is then transferred into the storage chests by shafts or slides. Water wheels were most commonly used in grain mills, but they were also found in iron forges, sawmills, and mines.